war. War never changes. In the year 1945, my great-great-grandfather, serving in the army, wondered when he'd get to go home to his wife and the son he'd never seen. He got his wish when the U.S. ended World War II by dropping atomic bombs on Hiroshima and Nagasaki. The world awaited Armageddon. Instead, something miraculous happened. We began to use atomic energy not as a weapon, but as a nearly limitless source of power. People enjoyed luxuries once thought the realm of science fiction. Domestic robots, fusion-powered cars, portable computers. But then, in the 21st century, people awoke from the American dream. Years of consumption led to shortages of every major resource. The entire world unraveled. Peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because of my time in the army taught me one thing. It's that war. War never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Hello and welcome. Uh, welcome to my new uh, new series I'm putting out. This is a pilot for my Fallout 4 game. I'm just going through and making a character. How does this work? So I've got a couple of presets already loaded in. So I'm just that one I actually quite like. This is one of my own ones. Not sure I like it. Do you know what? I'm going to go with that for now. As I was saying, yeah, welcome to my new series. This is a pilot for my Fallout 4 uh, game. Got a few mods installed. Um, I found a. Uh, I've been playing a nice arm mod which. Well, it's skimpy. It's still a bit de decent. And unlike some of the arm mods we've got, this one actually looks like it's clothing being worn. Not just um, sprayed on over the top of um, over the body. So we're just going to go through the, um, the beginning. Talk to Vault Tech Grep. So on this episode, we're probably obviously we're going to go through this bit. We're going to go into the vault. Um, if you've never ever seen Fallout 4, played it before, then shut your ears. We've got a bit of a spoiler coming up. We're going to shut. Good. Um, so yeah, we're going to go to the vault, we're going to get frozen, come out again, and come back uh, to Sanctuary, and talk to Cosworth, and maybe make a start with Sim Settlement 2, and um, that'll be this episode, so it's just getting going. Um, just literally got to wait for this to do what it's got to do. 
of course you must said I'm running just over 150 mods um got some armor in there got some weapons settlements uh some enemies got an ENB running as well I can't remember what it is I'll put all the um because I've only got 150 mods I'll drop my load order into the um that salesman again into the description below and I'll also probably start I will start putting on my vortex as well, uh, vortex discord as well Vortex calling uh, no offense, but sod off. <laughs> no offense, but no soliciting. Oh, no worries, ma'am. No worries at all. I'm not selling anything. Not today. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. Uh, but maybe I don't want to talk to you. Maybe I don't want to talk to you. No. Oh. <clears throat> you do. Now I know you're a busy woman, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being, um, <laughs> a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entrance into the local vault. Vault 111. Uh, just go away. Won't take but a moment. We do need to verify some information to make sure you're cleared for entrance in the unforeseen event of <clears throat> total atomic annihilation. Come back some other time. Come on, hun. It's just a little paperwork. Let him fill it out, and it's done. Okay. Uh, okay. You talked me into it. Just need to get this pesky info all squared away. Okay, name is Annabelle, because I can't think of another one. So these are all going to be up to number three. Now I'm going to pump a couple more into these, but most into intelligence. Because then I get more experience. I'm going to up quicker. Uh, just going to walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um... Thanks again. Hey, it's peace of mind. That's worth a little paperwork, right? For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Miss Bell, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to call me out. I think he needs some of that maternal affection you seem to be so good at. <laughs> Go ahead, honey. I'll be there in a second to help, okay? My boy isn't giving his mother any trouble, is he? Hey, I fixed that mobile on his crib the other day. Why don't you give it a spin? That's my boy, on his best behavior, just like his dad. Well, most of the time, anyway. Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Now I want to do pumpkins. Let's get pumpkins instead. Carve jack-o'-lanterns. Sir? Mum? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get confirmation. What? We seem to have lost what contact with our affiliate stations. Oh, no. We do, we do have... We do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports. I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh, my God. We need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Yeah, while we're legging it there, um, you are I would like your feedback on, on this game, what you think of it. We'd like to see me add. Do you want to take stuff out of it? Um, also, give me some ideas for some mods as well. Something that's going to add to the game. Add immersion. Um, make it look better. More apocalyptic if, if necessary. And 
to some mods that you want to see still um you don't get it i'm going in you can't just don't break that game or something oh 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 okay okay i'm reporting this if you're in the program step forward i'm gonna die we need to get in we're on the list infant adult male adult female okay go ahead thank you Good luck, sir. Follow me. Come on. What's going to happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? Everything we can. Now keep moving. Step on the platform in the center. All right, that's it. Send him down. Almost there. Is Sean okay? He's fine. We're going to be okay. I love you. Oh my God. Duck. Yeah. Hold on! Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! We did it. We made it. Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. We'll get everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we Ladies just first, oh boy. Up the stairs. I can't believe it. Vault 10 is here for you. Just this oh, no, 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 don't get caught up thinking please about that. Please proceed You're safe in an orderly fashion. Well done. Welcome. This one's good. Step over to the table and take a seat. You'll need your this seats way. before we can take you Thanks. first. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right, you three. Follow me. See? This way, please. This is our new home. There is something I want to do quick. And that's um, activate my immersive HUD. Must have had another dust than the one I was looking for. Oh, you're gonna love it here. This is one of our most advanced facilities. Not that the others aren't great, mind you. Levels are good. It's gone. Our home. Everything we had. My mother and father down in DC. How long do you think we'll be down here? Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Um, Just a few medical items you have to get through first. Yeah, give it a tight ten. Good fit. Just yeah, checking back. everyone the off the list as they come in. to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Such a lovely family you have. I hope you'll see this as your new home. Just step in here and put your vault suit on. Oh, again, yeah, this one. It'll be okay. Yeah. Mommy's right here. Sean's acting up. Pod will decontaminate and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five, four, three, two, one. Let the boy go. 
Oh, let's get out of here then. Come on. There has to be a release. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, God. Come on, Mike. I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise. I'm not a doctor. Actually, I'll be back later. <laughs> Fair enough. <clears throat> I don't think uh, the doctor's going to be able to help. <coughs> going to pick up and take all the uh, scrap and junk ready for when we get to our settlement. Size of that thing. Ooh. So bear with me while I um, literally rob the place of everything it's got that I can possibly get my hands on. It doesn't seem to matter how much junk you gather, or how much scrap you pick up, never quite enough. Get off. Giant roaches? What the hell? I'm not sure there's anything in here. We sleep in the bed. I don't need to do that. I've just been asleep for 200 years. I'm hardly going to be tired. everything in here. Let's go smack some roaches. Push me then. Horrible oh, little critters. Nice. I got a gun now. I can shoot him. I put some glasses on. I can't put one yet. Open the tunnel, please. Well, as you can probably work out, I'm not going to get bogged down into the history of this place and, and all the rest of it. Most of you probably know it anyway, those that played it and those that haven't, I'm sure you've probably watched that. Your videos on it already to know what's going to happen. Know that what the story is with these um, vaults. And you know what? This cryo later in here, never ever come back for it. Yeah. Let's try uh, one of these, shall we? We'll be Boom. Oh my god, I can't even hit it at point blank range. Wasting bullets now. Ugh. 
the hell's that? Red spider hatchling. Oh, please don't be spiders in this, not big spiders. Let's try ambushing me as well, that's what you get. Oh look, now the door's open. What happened here? Where is everyone? Goes the pit boy. Most important piece of equipment in the whole game. Select a tab with mouse. Okay. D, 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 D. Change things with A and D. Put the glasses on. Give me plus one perception. And tab to exit. Okay, I guess we're going to leave this place behind us now. This door, I just love the way this opens up. Don't do it then. Into the light. I'm happy with my attributes, name and appearance, thank you. Enjoy your return to the surface and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. Using the mouse wheel to adjust my view. Okay. So a quick scout around, see what we got. But I said I'll gather as much junk and trash as I can. As well as, well as ammo and weapons. Because I'm going to run out at some point.
Yeah, so what's happened to our home then? Cotsworth. As I live and breathe. Oh, it's it's really you. Codsworth, what happened to the world? The world, Mum? Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills. I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Sir back. Where is your better half, by the by? Better half? Bloody cheek. They... They killed him. Oh, Mum, these things you're saying, these terrible things, I, I believe you'll need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this, this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or, or perhaps charades. Oh, Sean does so love that game. <laughs> is, is the lad uh, with you? Sean's been kidnapped. But I'm gonna find him. I'm gonna get my baby back. It's worse than I thought. You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, Mum. Give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> That means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack. You must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting a little weird. What's wrong? I... I... Uh, Mum, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets out nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. <laughs> oh, nothing! And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car, how do you polish rust? Stay with me, pal. Focus. I'm afraid I don't know anything, Mum. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were, were dead. I, I did find this holotape. I believe Sir was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. Thank you, Codsworth. You're, you're welcome. Enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? Sir and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, Mum. Yay. Right. What have we got going on over here then? Let's go do it then.
Good done then, Codsworth. Codsworth. Miss Bell. Your, your family isn't here. Oh, Miss Bell, Annabelle. Got my name right. They're really gone, aren't they? Thanks for trying, Codsworth. You can't give up, Mum. What about the city? Concord is nearby, and, well, even the people there have only shot at me a few times. Thanks for your help, Codsworth. Good luck, Mum. You'll find young Sean. I know you will. I shall remain here and secure the home. All right. Now, normally at this point, I would go around and spend about 45 minutes an hour just scrapping everything. But we've got Sims Settlement 2 installed. And I think, if I'm if I'm correct, there we go. We leave everything, and Sims Settlement will um. Do the scrapping, so we're going to give that a try. Uh, power on this. Lenius. Alright, have we got enough stuff to make a generator? No, I need copper. Great. I should be able to get that from here, shouldn't I? Still rubber feet, no copper. Right, so I can't build a generator. What can I get copper out of? Aha. Steel and wood have a television. There we go, I've got some copper. Somebody over there already. It didn't take him long to cut turn up, did it? Attention, hey, hello there. Are if I'm not mistaken, you're the gal I've been settle. looking for. Can I help you? I heard your radio broadcast. Sounded as if you were starting some kind of settlement. Is that about the right of it? Are you looking for a new place to settle? Not me, no. But I Not have something sure to about these teeth and smile. Are. Looks like Roger Rabbit. Here, catch. It's called an ASAM sensor. If you're going to be building settlements, Not these that. things are what you'll want to use. Yeah. Why is that? Mm, I think a demonstration is in order. Place that ASAM down on the ground somewhere. Go ahead. Any old spot will do. Any old spot. Okay, let's stick it right up the back here. Build a this might have been, but a city planner's desk. Congratulations! You've made the smart move of choosing Grupke brand ASAM sensors for your city planning needs. Unlike other less reliable multi-purpose sensors, Rupke brand ASAM sensors offer the level of versatility and connectability that you Rocco Brand ASAM Sensors, America's number one sensor solution. Just chicken and punch him with both Nicely done. Don't mind the ASAM, it's just scanning the area for materials. Getting scanned now. Mm -hmm. Whoa. 
Now for this next part, I'm gonna pretend to be a settler. Just come to work for you. So just play along, all right? <clears throat> I have to. Boy, I sure am glad I found this settlement to live in. But oh no, there are no homes available. And I don't know how to build one myself. I guess I'll just have to rely on whoever runs this place to build a home for me. Don't sell yourself short. You're right. If only I had a little guidance, I could probably build something myself. But wait, what is this? Why, it's an ace, Sam! Just the thing I need! What do you need it for? That <laughs> is a great question. You see, with an ace, Sam, there's no barrier for entry when it comes to building something. All I'd need to do is follow the step-by-step -step instructions provided by the ace, Sam. Here, let me show you. Dude, I'll see what you can do. Once you've placed down a sensor, your role in the construction is pretty much done. <laughs> Just about anyone in the settlement can claim the area and start building for themselves. Directions that the ASAM provides are so easy to understand, even a savage could do it with no problem. All right, just one more nail and finished. A man's home is his castle, and no one understands that better than Rocco. Our extensive cool. technology offers citizens oh, unrivaled freedom of DIY home That's design. Chill. That's sun danger. Built using locally sourced materials and designed via our patented dynamic easy build roofing software. With Rocco brand XM sensors, everyone can have a roof over their head. After all, a warm and dry citizen chair. is a productive citizen. And there you have it. A fully built home. Ready for habitation by some lucky wastelander. And you barely had to lift a finger. Not too shabby, huh? So now that you've seen what they can do, what do you think? Are right, Sam sensors something you might be interested in? Good pay. Yes. I'm really interested. <laughs> I thought you might be. Unfortunately, right now I only have the one sensor on me. However, I can provide you with more. And once you have more, I can show you even more stuff you could build with them. Homes are just the start. But first, I'm gonna have to ask for a little task done in return. That sounds about right. Of course. Just tell me what you need help with. All right, here it is. I got me a workshop at a town called Concord. Nice enough place, fairly quiet. Well, at least it was. But just recently, I returned from a trade run to find the entire town overrun by raiders. And now I can't get near my workshop. A small group I could deal with, but there's too many for me to take on alone. So I'm gonna need someone to help take them out. So there it is. That's the job. You help me get rid of these raiders, I'll give you more ASAMs. And show you how to build even more stuff with them. Sounds good to me. Don't worry. I'll help you deal with these raiders. You will? Oh, that's great. Okay then. Let's head to Concord and show those raiders who's boss. Lead on. Okay, Concord is going to be the next episode. We've got our first place down. Alright, okay, so yeah, we're going to wrap this episode up here. Um, let me know if anything you want me to add in, if you want me to take away, any mods you want to see me add in, or do you think will enhance the game or add to it, make it a little bit better. Um, but I do appreciate you watching my, my video and if you did enjoy it please hit the like button below and also I really appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel and yeah this is Anna Bell um, saying goodbye for now but she'll be back next week in another episode of Fallout 4 Modded until then 
look after yourselves and take care and thank you for watching hope you enjoyed it bye bye